Let me guess. You found one of those ridiculous handbills Reginus posted all over town. Gods, it's like we're holding auditions for the children's theater. Please understand, this is a serious commitment. You really wish to join the Antiquarian Circle? The University of Gwylem's most prestigious historical society. We scour the continent for lost antiquities, collecting and cataloging as we go. We've made hundreds of discoveries, thanks in no small part to our scrying tool, the Antiquarian's Eye. An invention of our university's founder, Chirain Fire. It allows the wielder's mind to travel vast distances and find buried relics, truths lost to history. Gazing into the eye requires no small measure of talent. How talented are you, I wonder? Admission to the circle begins easily enough. Just place your hand on the antiquarian's eye. If you possess the aptitude, you will attune to the eye immediately. If you don't possess the aptitude, the eye will reject you. Couldn't be simpler. It's a magnificent device, alien in origin. As I said before, our university's founder, Chirain Fire, developed it along with countless other scholarly tools. Alas, he died before we could demonstrate the object's true potential. It homes in on objects of historical import, much like a bloodhound, without all the baying and drooling, of course. We still don't fully understand how it determines an item's value. Just more proof of our founder's genius, I suppose. We recovered several from a vault in Elenir. It seems Sage Fire intended for the university's best and brightest to continue his work after he was gone. It took longer than he would have liked, I'm sure. But I fully intend to honor his legacy. We seek the truth above all else. Written histories rarely give an honest accounting of the past, so we go straight to the source. Relics, curios, even ancient bric-a-brac. Anything that can teach us more about the myriad cultures of Tamriel. Uh, I assume you mean commercially valuable? Yes, you can keep any relics you recover and do with them what you will. The Circle's chief concern is cataloging the discoveries and learning what we can from them. Everyone benefits from the arrangement. It's a school, of course. The very best, by any credible assessment. At least it was. Uh, but I wouldn't give to walk those halls again. This frigid annex is a very poor substitute. Very poor, indeed. For a time, I studied there as well. Despite all of Cyrodiil's struggles, I really did believe we could weather the storm. But war has far-reaching consequences, even for those who want no part in it. Especially for those who want no part in it. Here and elsewhere, the faculty scattered to the winds when the plane mail took hold. Fortunately, most of us survived, and we write each other constantly. I wound up in Skyrim somehow. As frozen wastelands go, it's really quite pleasant. You mean to join the circle? That's great! That's really, really great! So I'd love to indulge in introductions, but I've just had a thought, and you know how that goes. Pop in, pop out, have to commit it to paper. So, you know, goodbye. So, looking to earn a place in the circle, eh? Good. We could use a few sturdy scholars around here. So far, so good, eh? You're making fine progress. You'll be a member of the Circle soon enough.
live. We rarely see such an energetic attunement. Well, well, well. It seems I underestimated you. With a reaction like that, you may well rival Gabrielle, our most accomplished antiquarian. I wonder what secrets you might find gazing through the eye. In a hurry, are we? We'll teach you to use the eye in due course. First, do you vow to uphold the principles and traditions of the Circle, to catalog your discoveries for future generations and give a true accounting of Tamriel's history? An excellent decision. Mastering the eye is no small endeavor. But with Gabriel's tutelage and my rigorous oversight, we may make a true scholar of you yet. Welcome to the Circle, Antiquarian. Now then, we should begin your education in earnest. I suggest you speak with Gabriel Benale. I can provide some scholarly advice, but when it comes to using the Antiquarian's eye itself, you'll find no better teacher than Gabrielle. Downstairs, poring over more maps and tomes, no doubt. Honestly, the girl never stops working. I'd almost think she was trying to make the rest of us look bad if she wasn't so confoundedly cheerful. At any rate, she'll get you sorted. Speak with me again once Gabrielle's taught you the basics. I know I can come across as... chilly. But truthfully, I'm anxious to get you into the field. Oh, it's you! What a welcome surprise! By Mara, that business with Angoff feels like lifetimes ago. I'm glad to see you're still in good health. So, Verida gave you an antiquarian's eye, eh? You mean to join the antiquarian circle? Ugh, searching mostly. I couldn't rest knowing Darian was still out there, trapped in the colored rooms. I want to help him, speak to him somehow, you know? But it's just not that simple. Darian returned? Then where is he now? Why hasn't he contacted me? But he was here. He was here and I missed my chance to... When you say he disappeared, what do you mean? Did he say anything? So, he doesn't think he's coming back again? So much for Derry and the plucky optimist. The important part is we know escape is possible. I'm not giving up on him. We'll find a way to get him back for good. I know it. So, chins up, right? Wow, really? That's uncharacteristically gracious of her. Huh. Well, anyway, let's get started. It all begins with concentration. The eye wants to show you what you seek. So, clear your thoughts, and conjure up a picture of the relic in your mind. The exciting part. Gaze into the eye and focus on the facets in the glass. Take a breath and try to unify the symbols into a single pattern. Eventually, you'll stop looking at the lens and start looking through it. Why don't we just give it a try? Don't fret. I mean, sure, it's not as if we're learning to boil rice down here. But someone with your innate talents should take to the process quite well. And like most things, you'll only improve with practice. Well done. Now fix your eyes on the center and the corners of the lens. Then turn your focus inward toward the facets in the glass. Concentrate and the facets should merge. Unifying the lens into a single pattern will perfectly attune the eye, but you'll have provided. I'll meet you in the courtyard. I don't care what you say. The killer in Stormhold was a shadow scale. I hate asking. But spare some coin. I was exiled after I chose to liberate some Argonians many, many years ago. I'd make the same choice, but right now, my circumstances are less than ideal. Looks like this is the spot. Time to excavate the antiquity. Remember to move cautiously. 
Use the right tool for the right level of excavation, and don't rush yourself. Even careful digging can result in an unsteady dig site, so be mindful of its stability. There you have it. You're a proper antiquarian now. Seems you have quite a knack for it, too. Just keep practicing with the antiquarian's eye and master those digging techniques. I'm confident you'll be recovering priceless relics in no time. I'd report back to Verida and let her know you successfully extracted your first... antiquity. Don't expect too much in the way of praise, but trust me, she'll be ecstatic. Once you've checked in, start looking for relics. No time like the present, eh? Welcome back, Antiquarian. I trust your time with Gabrielle was illuminating? Excellent. I had a good feeling about you, and as usual, I was right. From now on, consider yourself free to pursue any antiquities that interest you. We will catalog your findings for study, and together we will uncover the mysteries of this world. You have a great deal of work to do, Antiquarian. Wouldn't you...